Hi everyone, welcome to a new video. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to fix a problem with this kind of Samsung. Uh, maybe there is another Samsung. Uh, but this Samsung, it's a Pro Express M4070FR. So this machine, whenever I could make, uh, try to, to make a copy like this, then it say not available. Make a copy, it say not available. I say, what's going on? So I called one of the technicians from who was do good with Samsung. It's called um, David. David said it could be the toner. So I told the client, please let's go buy the toner. We bought the toner. We put in a new toner. Still the same thing. Right? Okay. Then what did I do else? Uh, he said it could be the fuser. So he said go to the fuser. Open the fuser. Touch the fuser at the back. See if it's hot. I say it's hot. Okay. He said it's not the fuser. Why? Because the fuser is heating up. If it was not heating up, it's not going to be the problem. Here. So I said, get it okay. Now what's next? David, he was busy then. He couldn't help me. Then what I did, I did my research to find out that this was the issue. The, the issue, I don't know. Anyway, I don't know the issue. But I know how to fix the issue. Anyway, what you do, you do this, right? But this is going to be a little bit faster. You press, you're going to press like this. You're gonna press menu ash nineteen thirty four menu. Okay, then you go to take what to take you to take menu. Then when it takes you to take menu, you you you, you click OK. When you click OK, it's gonna take you to information. Uh, then you could on th these are the same machines, but you can find maybe the 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 the, 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 the firmware is different. Then you can click here on what uh information this shows you reports but there's configurations supply information usage count and all that you get me so when you there when you click on configurations okay what is it it's a print no i don't want to print okay so some gonna work like that why because the the firmware could be different okay you don't go there you go back you go back on the reports you then instead of taking that you can see there's maintenance accounts and diagnostics and service functions then go to service functions right click there once you click there clear all mem but in other machines it could be that you might go where i went first you understand because of what same machines but because of the software could be different but on mine this is the way to have. then you click on clear me all mem okay when you click there it's gonna give you south africa you say okay then it's clearing but sometimes it might ask you for the password the password for this one is 1934 right remember the number also which i say you say press menu you understand in the first place you press menu hash 1934 menu so 1934 1934 is the same thing as the password but it, there's no hash when you put in the password in case it asks you say say successful after saying successful it's gonna reboot after rebooting it will allow you to make a copy but these are the steps but um, here we, we, the steps here are not the same day with uh, we, we, we we changed one because mine had a different a slightly different menu press menu then ash 134 then menu then then menu again then it's gonna take you to take menu then from there you click information but on mine I didn't click information, I clicked another button, you saw it. Then service functions, then clear all mem, which clear all memories. So mine is showed South Africa, yours it could show USA or German or whatever country you're in, the way they set it on that country. So it's back here and I can make a copy. Let me make copy one copy. It won't give me that. It was giving me that before but even the time i showed you it has already been fixed because i could i didn't know huh. okay okay that's it but also there's an alternative on this in case it 
doesn't work out but you cleared the memory and stuff whatever i say you can try also to put what to put what they call a new firmware on that it's beyond this the scope of our tutorial i can't tell you that but uh, you have to put new what firmware so my machine is fine but it was giving me some big big stress uh yeah i think that's it please 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 don't forget to to, to subscribe but anyway i can repeat the steps for you you press menu 19 okay no it won't go like that let me go back 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 i'm gonna say menu ash 1934 menu you must be quicker you see it didn't take me there you see it didn't take, you must be quicker a little bit quicker let me see i'm trying to say cancel this okay waiting for canceling okay gonna say menu let me put the, the menu slash 1934 menu then we take you to take menu then from take menu say okay then say information whatever i don't go there you see mine this instructions i showed you there it takes you there to the what i saw but now you go to not, not meta, diagnostics no service function you go to service function right okay then after they say okay then you say clear all you understand that's what you clear you understand that's when you're done so anyway uh this year yeah also it shows service function but something you don't don't you skip this you go then you go to service function you understand you don't click on that uh, you click on service functions sorry guys okay these are the steps and that could be the password for you press menu then hash 1934 then menu then it it's gonna take you to but on this step you have to be very fast i'm saying very fast okay that's it um then to take you there then you press that then whenever i say then you say when then you press ok select this press ok then go to service functions then clear all mem or say memory then you show your country select the country boom you're done thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to subscribe i uh, hope to see you in the next video yeah that's it uh, that was a, a problem, but it's done.